And that was freaking exciting. I think I had a world-class spotter. He was throwing signals I've never seen before. Either that or I just joined a gang, I'm not sure. All right, day one, Moab. Headed to the Branding Iron to stage for our first trail, which is Sales Revenge. I'm pretty excited about that, I think. Um, actually, I have no idea, but uh, it's renowned. I just just lost Dusty at the stoplight, so um, hopefully he'll catch up. Gators with me today. We've got Dave Laws. He will be our tailgater. Just finished our pre-driver driver meeting, left the branding iron, we're heading to the trail ahead for Hell's Revenge. And uh, we're aired down, we're ready to go. We'll see, uh, see what else we learn up here. But uh, I'm kind of excited. Uh, I've never been to Moab, this is a big deal to me. Uh, I've never uh, crawled on this type of rocks or played around in this stuff. So I don't even have really any idea what we're getting into, but, uh, but we learn fast. Hell's Revenge, day one, EJS, Moab. I haven't said it. I'm excited. I can tell Dusty's excited because he's going to the bathroom again. Right now, I'll tell you what's going through his mind. A brand new Gladiator is gonna get a scratch and he's freaking out because Dusty's type A. When Dusty's Jeep gets dirty, Dusty washes said Jeep. I don't know what he's gonna do when uh, said Jeep gets denty. <laughs> I hope that doesn't <laughs> And scratchy. Today. Hope that doesn't happen today. It's gonna be denty Dusty. It's gonna be a good day. <laughs> it's gonna be a good day. I, should, I didn't even look down to see what the pitch was coming up that thing. <laughs> I forget I have these uh, off-road pages in the dash or to my come out wheeling. You got it, baby. Stay passenger. He's watching. Driver. Little guy. There you go. Okay, come on. Now go passenger. Passenger. The other passenger. Right. Towards us. There you go. You're good. <laughs> You're going to get a little bump. So come passenger a little. There you go. It's gonna drop, it's gonna feel weird. Yeah, he's gonna be fine. Just keep your right. little four passenger, keep your sidewalk pressure there, you'll be fine. And then you're good. How do you not hit his tailgate? I don't know. <laughs> there you go. Nice job, Dusty. <laughs> that seat will polish out. <laughs> Good job, Dusty. Nice spot. <laughs> <laughs> Think dust. Nice. Get a little flexy. A little bit. That thing made it look like it was nothing. All right, getting ready to do Hell's Gate. Got some butterflies. Sending in a line. That's the worst part. Is just waiting for my chance to go. See some people walking up it. Um, doing exactly what the spotter says. Hopefully I do the same. And we're going up the gatekeeper of Hell's Gate. <laughs> it's <was> definitely exciting. <laughs> oh, shit. Hell's Gate, now we're headed over to some of the bathtubs. Check those out. And this has been a great trail up to them. Just lots of up downs, lots of small climbs. Loving it. Uh, Emmy's doing great. The middle is doing great. Most of the time, I don't need my lockers. I figured out. I'll turn the compressor on just to be safe. But uh, man, this stuff's so sticky. There's so much traction. It's like perfect.
log jam here. Um, what I assume is on our way back out, uh, just based on what time it is. But uh, it's a beautiful scenery, unbelievable. Terrain's awesome, traction is incredible today. Um, just all around a good time. Richard's doing well, first time in four low, first time with lockers. Um, not having any real trouble other than that. Hemi wants to go. You better be on the brake when you want to stop. And uh, you better be on the brake hard when you put it in drive because uh, it's got enough torque. It just wants to keep rolling. So it's my only uh, thing that I'm really having to get used to. First time with an automatic. Uh, but uh, I feel like I'm uh, feel like I'm getting the hang of it. I'm definitely not confident in it, but uh, do feel better. All right, we're moving again. We're on uh, Scorpion Tail, I believe is what they called it. And uh, we're starting a pretty steep climb down. We just went past another uh, tub or bathtub or hot tub or whatever it is, but we didn't have time to stop playing it. And it looked kind of nasty anyway. I think they called them Mickeys. Um, so they look pretty tight. Looked like a good way to bash something up on day one. <laughs> so uh, we're going to continue to ease out of here. I think uh, we are on the exit right now. We're on our way out. So it's very steep. I see why it's going slow. It's very, very steep. Let's see what the kilometer says. We're at 12 right now and we're not to the drop off yet. So I bet we're in the high 20s before we get to the bottom of it, which for me is super steep. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> As Dusty disappears off into the horizon. <laughs> yeah, the Hemi's doing great. The conversion is incredible. Great amount of torque. Put this thing in manual one and four low, two. Hardly have to touch the brakes. And just use the engine. It's uh, plenty of torque. I'm not spinning a bunch of this stuff. I started off running my lockers on like I would have done um, in my JK. Um, and Clifford, but didn't need them, man. Tons of traction here. Running it open most of the time so I can steer. <laughs> and uh, I don't think there's any sense in risking breaking an axle when I didn't need to lock them anyway. So suspension's working good. I thought it might have been a little set up a little stiff because of the way we run in Baja, but man, it's doing a great job out here. All right, tell me what you got going on here. Well, I'm on a Jeep trip. <laughs> this is what you do on a Jeep trip. You come here, you redo what you did at home, especially when you were hurrying to get here. So uh, the ARB twin compressor just turned on by itself on the trail and wouldn't shut off and the pressure switch never made up. Um, scared me a little bit. So I uh, started pulling stuff off underneath the dash, <laughs> pulling my radio out to get to the power cable. Couldn't get to the disconnect. So I just opened up the hood, pulled the main lead off of everything back here, shut off the fridge and the whole, the whole back end. But um, from what we're reading online, we think it may be one of these. Uh, switches or relays and uh, we're testing that now. Ooh, scared me. That's it. This is awesome. We're having so much fun. Unbelievable. Enjoying it. A little bit uh, exciting in places. So Kind of good to get a thrill again, off-roading, kind of like Baja was, it was new, it was exciting. I've never been here, so this is a big deal to me. Glad I'm not uh, not seasoned at this, I, I just wouldn't trade this feeling right now for anything.